All right, thank you, Bob. Well, retired NFL player Michael Orr says the family he thought legally adopted him as a teenager actually misled him into signing a conservatorship. Orr is accusing the Tui family of making millions from a movie about his life and other deals while he made nothing. The Tuies have denied the accusations. ABC's Justin Finch has you covered on those details. Former Baltimore Ravens first round draft pick Michael Orr, whose rise from poverty to pro football and adoption by a well to do white family inspired the Michael Lewis book and 2009 Oscar winning film The Blind Side, now saying he was blindsided. How can I help you? I would like to become a legal guardian. Lord, help that child. In a 14-page petition filed in a Tennessee court, Ower accuses Sean and Leanne Tui of deceiving him into signing what he thought were adoption papers, but actually was a conservatorship. Sean Tui telling the Daily Mythian newspaper that lawyers advised them to pursue a conservatorship because Ower was 18 and too old to legally adopt. Tui says they thought Ower needed to be part of their family to comply with NCAA rules to play college football. But the pro football star is accusing the Tuis of negotiating deals for themselves and their two birth children, alleging they got paid more than $200,000 each, plus a percentage based on the movie's success. Though the blind side made more than $330 million, Ower says he made nothing. The two were speaking to ABC in 2010 after releasing a book about their experience. Michael's life necessarily wouldn't have been changed if we just wrote a check. He needed our time and our attention. The Tuies have previously said they only received a flat fee from the film, sharing their earnings with Orr. Orr asking that the court end the conservatorship and bar the Tuies from profiting from using his name and likeness as he seeks potential unpaid profits and damages. Michael says he's owed millions of dollars. It's going to be a question of an accounting of the revenue. Sean Tui also told the Daily Mythian newspaper that he and his wife are devastated by Orr's petition and, quote, didn't make any money off of the blind side. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.